Yo, what is going on guys? So Vian over here and I'm back with another uh, tip video. So quick disclaimer, a tip it is not any formal advice or anything like that. It's something that is based off a conversation with a friend, partner, student, whatever it is, right? And I think hey, you know what, you guys can benefit from this and hence the video, okay? So just keep that in mind that it is a tip that I want to share with you guys. And if you guys of course like this video, I will be sure to like, share, and subscribe as always, right? So from the headline and thumb or thumbnail rather, you guys have seen the topic. Now, when it comes to affiliate marketing or anything, uh, basically anything in my opinion, consistency is key, right? It goes without saying where, <coughs> whether you are learning a new skill, you're practicing something new. If you're not consistent and do and practicing, practicing it daily, regularly rather, you will lose touch, you will be out of touch, and you will not be good at it. So, consistency in a flame marketing as an affiliate, what do we or should we be consistent at? So, it is a few things. So, for instance, you want to be consistently posting content on any platform that you operate on, whether it, it is you, is it YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok whatever it is you will want to be consistent and be posting regularly in fact if you have a schedule a routine like stick by it so for me if you guys have been following my channel i have been posting on youtube every single day since the start of this year but since the start of 2022, I've been posting one YouTube video every single day. And that has brought me revenue from YouTube. That has brought me leads from YouTube. That has brought me more brand awareness from YouTube and so much more benefits just by me being consistent, all right? And what are the things that I'm doing quite regularly? So Facebook, I'm always engaging with people. I'm very on the ball with what I'm doing. And moving forward to 2023, I'll be expanding this, uh, this consistency throughout other platforms such as TikTok, for instance, right? Now, other things that you guys may want to know is always consistently be researching and studying what is the things that you are lacking what are you not so good at or what are you not so confident at? That is something that we as entrepreneurs, we need to develop and learn where we need to always be upgrading ourselves or rather I keep this mo uh, model where it's going to be 1% better every single day. Now, if I can do that, that is basically me living up to my, expe my own expectations, brother. So be consistent in running campaigns. Right? You want to keep testing campaign, find that winning campaign and better understand is it the, the creative or is it the traffic or is it your target audience? Only through being consistent in exploring, testing and trying having multiple trial and errors, that's where you can discover the, the proverbial winning formula. The other thing that we want to be consistent at is about let's say writing emails now a lot of people are still funnily enough underestimate the power of email marketing but it's because they do not know how to write an, a good email and good email and that is a shame because email marketing is so freaking powerful and it doesn't take more than 10 minutes a day to craft an email schedule it and let it fly at an optimal time, right? So only when you combine your a consistent effort in researching, in trying to better understand what kind of emails to write, what are what the styles are there that will appeal to your audience, how to boost your open rates, how to boost the click through rate. If you are not consistent. In making those conscious effort to know to test to identify you will not have a sort of style you will not have the organic connection with your audience and you will most 
certainly lose out in this aspect as compared to other creators, other of your competitors, and so much more. Right? Being consistent in running this business is very, very important. And <coughs> I this is a topic that I really need to talk about because I know it is easy to be lazy. I know it is it's super easy to procrastinate. I do that a lot of time, most of the time, in fact, rather. I know it is easy to just screw it, right? You know, just take a day off and whatnot. But you have to ask, is it worth taking a day off so that you, you find excuses? You give yourself excuses not to grow or be better well you guys have heard this before from me i i pledge sort of pledge not really sort of but really i do aim to be at least one percent better every single day learning something reading something knowing more chatting up with people building relationship to me that is slightly that is at the very minimum one percent every uh, better every day if i were to be on good terms with uh with my mentors or a top affiliate top creator i see that as growth building important relationships right so do not give yourself the excuse to not do something that is important to you and your business basically more important is the vision that you have for yourself if you are not willing to put in the work how can you expect the work to bring you result it's, it is a very simple chain of thought right so i want every single one of you guys who are watching this video to really understand being consistent is very important when you're running this business whether it is email marketing social media marketing tracking your campaigns building relationships with your mentor, peers, students, friends, whatever. If you're not consistent, it is detrimental for your business. All right. So that is all I want to share for this video. I hope you guys like this video. If you guys did, I appreciate sure like, share, subscribe. As always, feel free to comment. Let me know your thoughts and I'll get back to you guys as soon as I can. Check out my channel as I have so many useful information, at least in my opinion, useful information that you guys can definitely benefit from. I talk about Facebook ads, reviews, I talk about other tip videos, I talk about motivational videos, I talk about strategies that I teach us, I, that I teach my students, and I even have interviews with top names like Philip Johansson and so much more. So check out my channel if you guys want to check out more other awesome content. And that is all I want to share for this video. Thank you guys for watching and I'll speak to you guys in my next one. Cheers.